Is anyone there? Oh. Hi. How's it gamers? It's your boy Wotan. Before I get into my video here though, I want to highlight as I pointed out before that I just really wanted to start doing series for more long form vlogging. A lot of the time on the main show, whenever we have time for that, <laughs> that is, I want to get into more complex tech or, or more complex tech topic or just, you know, longer monologues and I just can't do that with the host. Also, it's just fun to have footage of me gaming solo or me and my dipshit mates having a blast. Speaking of having a blast, I decided to make the background video of this uh, video, me and my, my buddy and I playing War Thunder. Just for the meme, we decided to run tier 1's V-dish IKEA tanks and we had the time of our lives. If you haven't downloaded the game, I highly recommend it. It's not an endorsement of any kind, I just really love the game. All you need is your Steam account. I also know it's 100% on other platforms, but I believe in the inherent superiority of the PC gaming master race, and so I refuse to acknowledge gaming on other platforms. Now back to the actual video. You know, for a while there's been this piece of wisdom floating around that if you want to live in a culture, you have to actively participate in creating it. It sounds incredibly self-evident, yet so few of us tend to actually do that. One aspect of this is content creation and consumption. Now, while mates of mine like Conscious Caracal have obviously put in good work in producing good content, the other half, consumption, deserves to be highlighted. There are two gentlemen that I'd like to highlight, and these are Sideline Opinions and Rory Duncan. Well, Sideline Opinions kind of just appeared, at least from my perspective, that's how it appeared. What I really appreciate about Sideline is that he'll always drop a really thoughtful comment on stuff that affects the culture. Beyond that, Sideline is about that life. If there's a stream creator whose work I enjoy and respect, my boy, like my boy Conscious Caracal or Colonel Chris Wyatt, bet your ass Sideline is there, and I love it. Thank you, Sideline, for being one of the unsung soldier heroes of podcasts and Twitter in general. Now, chapter two, Rory. Well, I would classify Sideline as a consumer of streams. Rory is a consumer of Twitter content. Granted, we had the pleasure of having Rory on our show, and it's honestly one of the most wholesome episodes uh, we've ever made. I still say one of his greatest inputs is that it is mostly on Twitter, both publicly on the timeline and in the DMs. His support and his words have always been welcome in my life. Now, this is one of the shortest videos I'll ever make, considering, but I think that's okay considering I'll be dropping two in short succession. And My whole point with this though was although creating culture is vital, the people who consume it are equally important. They deserve to be recognized, lifted up and appreciated. Kind of like the digital equivalent of village veterans who are perfectly within their rights to sit back and not have to take as active a role, yet choose to do so anyway to the benefit of all and to their increased veneration. I'm grateful for people like this. That's about it for me. It's a nice friends.